action today with bout number two. So let's call out both of our fighters in a two of the ring. First, making his way to the blue corner at this time, here is uh, Ivana Gordia. And making his way to the rib corner at this time, here is Arashamardani. This next bout, ladies and gentlemen, scheduled for four rounds of boxing in the cruiserweight division. And the referee in charge of this action from Thailand, Tanabot Swai Kao. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing blue trunks with gold trim. Officially weighing in at 197 pounds. Tonight, he returns to the ring for his second victory as a pro from Russia. Damia Gaspada, Pritzablea, Ivana Go. And as opponent across the ring, fighting out of the red corner on my right, wearing full bat trunks, officially weighing in at the cruiser weight limit of 200 pounds. This multiple time Greco Roman wrestling champion transitions into pro boxing tonight. And here, in search of his first victory, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome from Iran, Arash Mardani. And I want to get for the instructions, referee Adana Potswagel. Boxer, good night, good fight. No headbutt, no robo, okay? Good luck. Big boys in the ring right now. We have Arash Mardani and Ivan Gordiev, sch scheduled for four rounds or less. This in the cruiserweight division. Arash Mardani, a multiple time Greco Roman wrestling champion from Iran, who has had a couple of kickboxing fights in his career, decided to transition into boxing since he's been in Thailand for some time right now. And his opponent, Ivan Gordiev who's been in Bangkok, Thailand for a very long time, living over here and trains in a local gym. And uh, had his last fight almost two years ago, before the pandemic hit. It's, doesn't look like a guy who's got rusted over time because he isn't fighting due to the pandemic. Seems like he's been training well, keeping fit. Waiting the same as how he weighed in the last fight. Arash Mardani. strong overhand right taken well by Ivan Gordiev Ivan still yet to land a strong punch Ivan with a jab and a cross which didn't have much power in it both men still finding ways to gauge one another Ivan Gordiev finding his range Arash Mardani goes in with a flurry he's looking for that one big shot perfect metaphor for this fight would be a boxer going against a puncher. One man, all he knows is about power, tying his opponents up, beating them down. The other guy is trained to do it over 12 rounds or probably less. 
Here we have Ivan Gordiev. Arash Murdani with a jab. Both men still yet to find much range. So for those of you who just tuned in live to our Facebook live stream, this is Evolution M Pro Fight Series, and it's put together by a very passionate man for the sport of boxing, Nazar Moros, with uh, his very good friend, multiple-time WBC Asia Promoter of the Year, Alexander King, as they aim to turn Thailand into the mecca of boxing here in Southeast Asia. Arash Mardani with a left jab. Ivan Gordiev with lateral moves. Punch and a miss by Ivan Gordiev. Arash Mardani with a strong right hook to the body. Ivan Gordiev still finding his range. Last 10 seconds left. Any time right now. End of round one. Underway, the referee calls them both in. Arash Mardani, very obvious gameplay. He's trying to beat the jab of Ivan Gordiev and go straight to the body as he is pretty convinced by looking at the midsection of Ivan Gordiev that he can do some serious damage to his midsection. But let's see if that would come into fruition. Ivan Gordiev moves in with a left jab. Nothing much going up, steps out back again. Arash Mardani still trying to find. That one moment where he can land his strong right hand. Left hook by Arash Marjani. Didn't do much to Van Gordiev. Referee cautioning them to have some action. Only momentary action between the two cruiserweights here. Arash Marjani. It's obvious to see that he isn't much of a striker here. The only thing that he's trying to do is lunge in to the body. This is pretty much a wrestling move. And he's trying to incorporate a punch to that wrestling move. And he's trying to get the hang of it. It's pretty obvious. Ivan Gordiev obviously has a couple of professional fights in his career. As well as some amateur fights. Moving out of the range. But Arash Mardani proves to be a little dangerous. Especially at moments when he gets to catch Ivan Gordiev in those short distances, short gaps between the two of them, and especially when Ivan is caught against the ropes. Both men are sent of the ring. Arash still trying to find. Arash with another power lunging right hand. Done nothing to Ivan Gordiev. Ivan Gordiev still yet to land a punch. Arash with a strong right hand that pushes Ivan against the ropes. Ivan Gordiev, right hand. Lands straight on Arash Marjani's temple. But still not much. Oh, that was a strong right hand. And that dropped Ivan Gordiev. Ivan Gordiev, he should be going on the neutral corner. That's right. The referee gives Ivan Gordiev the count. Will he take up the count or will he beat the count? He's beat the count. Fantastic. The action is not over yet. Ivan Gordiev and Arash Marjani go head to head once again. Will this fight go on? Will it continue? Will Arash Marjani be able to continue the action? Will he be able to land another punch and drop Ivan Gordiev once again? Will Ivan Gordiev still stand strong? Ivan holding on with a left jab. And he drops Ivan Gordiev with a strong right hook. That's the end of this fight. Arash Mardani drops Ivan Gordiev here in round number two.
Ladies and gentlemen, I have your official time right here. Your winner, after two minutes and 18 seconds of round number two by way of knockout, here with his first win as a pro from Iran, Arash Mardani!